Hi, we're the Sea Strong Brothers. We're here from uh, Bayview Hunters Point, San Francisco. We um, do a little bit of Motown, R&B, a little bit of urban, all mixed in together. Back in 1969, 69 when the Jackson Fives came out, yeah. you know, that kind of inspired us. We just had a chemistry as brothers for years to come. Well, he's six fun. He was the oldest brother of us. He was just a gifted musician, played bass. Every entertainer that would come to town, they would want him on bass. They would look for him. But he had the talent, and he saw it in us, and you know, we just had the ears to hear it coordinates all the movements of, you know, uh, what's taking place on stage. When I'm on stage, I got, sometimes I have like a little butterfly, you know, because like it's, it's like new audience and new atmosphere. But we do kind of turn it up a little bit too, though. <laughs> so I take a little bit of this and take a little bit of that and coordinate that uh, just a little bit into our old school because we're, we're, we're old school and we just want to let the youngsters know we still got it, you know. As a writer, you try to learn to write about things that people have in common instead of once a year, a decade, or a trend, or a fad. You know, something that's going to be daily in their life that, hey, you know, I, that happened to me, or I've been through that before, you know. Something that means something to somebody. So I follow the feeling I get from it, and then and, and the love, the feeling of love is so strong, you just want to keep chasing that feeling, you know, you never want to let it go, you know. It's been a great adventure. Uh, if I have to do it all over again, I'd do it twice. It's kind of hard to describe uh, how big of a blessing it is to do what I do with my family. You know, if, if we can do it, it's not too late. It's not about how old you are. It's about what you love doing, and you continue to do that. I try to bring flavor, you know what I'm saying? I'm, I, I'm frisky, you know, I like to move, you know, so I bring that energy. I try to, you know what I mean? Sometimes I need a little kickstart, you know, and they, 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 they put the boot on me and I'm ready, I'm ready to roll. I've studied groups like Blue Magic, the OJs, the Temptations, the Dramatics. So today I use some of each and every one of those, you know, really a little piece of each one. I have some of my best moments on stage because that's, I don't know, I just, it just electrifies me. When I see him, and I see him, and I look over and I see them. He look like me and I look like him, and we know we organize, we don't rehearse, we well rehearse. It's a good feeling to come out there with them guys. Orlando bought a keyboard not too long ago, and he was playing some songs, some original stuff. We would always get together and run over original material, but we would just run over it. And I said, well, let's do our own thing. You know, let's do the c Strokes instead of doing the Whispers or Jacksons, you know. Let's do the c Strunk Brothers. So I started getting together with our stuff. And when we came up with our own original material, that was the goal that we found. And we called it California Go. Oh, no, I can love you like I do. Yeah, baby, girl, I got a love so true. I keep you from feeling blue. Oh, no one can love you like I do. Even go on our website, www.thecstrunkbrothers.com.